Discord. Ang Discord. <clears throat> Okay, so uh, can you see my screen? Can you see my screen? I need I need answer. Can you all see my screen? Yes. Okay. Okay. Good. Yes, teacher. So, good. Uh, okay. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Uh, today, I'm going to continue our lesson on uh, on uh, what on spreadsheet, uh, filling in data. Okay, on a table. Okay, so um, I have uh, asked you to fill uh, to create a table. Okay, I've asked you to create a table. And then from there, okay, from there, we will continue uh, with. <clears throat> okay, from there, we will continue our, uh, our work, okay? <clears throat> so all of you by now, you should have this, okay? Right now, all of us have this, this data, okay? And this data, as you can see, we have a b c d e f g h i j k i think 11 how many 11 uh, column right okay 11 uh, 11 cells okay yeah. 11 let me just okay so we have 11 here now from the data that we have we will fill in one by one okay we will fill in one by one uh, sorry, 11. Okay. The data uh, here. A, car A, car B, car C, car D, car E. What are the deal? Okay. What are the data that we have? Okay. So I haven't posted the data that we have here. What we have is this. Okay. This one will be posted later. Okay. This one will be posted uh, later in the group. Okay. I need you to look at this. Okay. Okay. Can you see the uh, information here? Yes. Okay. So what do you do now? From the data that we have here, we fill in, okay, price of new car, 42,000. We have car A, car B, car C, car D, and car E, okay? So price of new car, car A is 42K, okay, 42 Okay, trade in is 9K. Okay, let's fill in now. Car A, new car price is 42,000. Okay. Okay, when you are filling in, do not add letters. Sorry. <laughs> do not add letters. Okay, why? Why we don't add letters? Because what we need is just the number. We want to calculate only the number, not the letter. Not yet. The letter, letter one, not yet. Okay. Okay. So we fill in only the number. Okay. So minimum down payment. Look for the um, for the, the uh, information that we have here and fill in. Okay. So we have minimum down payment, ten k. 10, okay, okay, 10,000, okay, and then trade in price 9,000, duration 5 years, trade in offered price is how much, can you tell me, 9,000, 9, and then um, interest rate, what we have another one is interest rate 3.3, 3.35 per annum, okay, 3, interest rate, 3.35 percentage uh, per annum. Leave this first, fill in the number first, okay. So now, you can see what we have here. We have 
some column are filled in. Okay, some cells are filled in. Okay, but some are not. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six. We may need to. Okay, so leave it first. Fill in with whatever the information that you have. Okay, you have to know. Yeah, sometimes in exam they will give you some information. You have to fill in, and then there are certain things that they don't mention, but it's written in the form of question. Okay, so you have to uh, use your own judgment to add some other, uh, some other data, okay, by yourself, okay. In this case, the red one, we don't know, it's not given, okay, but go through the question one by one, you can see, they will give you, okay, one by one, they will give, okay. And some you have to figure out yourself. So let's. Okay. So now this one is in terms of number. Yeah. The percentage rate. You have to be careful. I'll come to percentage rate later. Let's go to car B. Okay. What do we have in car B? Car B. Price of new car is 48,350. Oh, I have to put here. Okay. Car B is. 35, eh, 48,000. Okay. 48,350. Okay. Minimum down payment. Okay. Minimum down payment is 10K also. 10,000. Do not fill in. Um, Trade in offered also 10,000. Do not fill in the letter, yeah? Duration, six years. Well, down payment. Duration, six years. Duration, the first one, car B is five years. And interest rate is 3.30, okay? Fill in first, later on. We think about, I think I want to recolor this. It's too bright. That's my eyes. <laughs> ah, this is better. Okay. So let's go to car C. Fill in first. Later on, we talk about formatting um, the type of number that we have here. Okay. So we have 45,000 car C, 45,000. Trade in price. Is 8K. And we have what? Yeah, minimum down payment still 10K. Duration 7 years. 3.20. The what? The percentage rate. Um, the interest rate. Car D is 32,000. Okay. And trade in price is seven five zero zero seven thousand five hundred. Minimum down payment is fifteen thousand. Duration four years. And interest rate is five percent. Okay. Car E we have thirty eight thousand. Okay, uh, trade in price six five zero zero. Eh, six five zero zero. Okay, <laughs> okay. Uh, minimum down payment is eight hundred. Eh, eight thousand. Allah. And duration of loan. Duration of loan is eight years. And it's 3% per annum, okay? So here, once you fill in um, uh, the data, you move on to the next information, next question what they have, okay? Here, you have to look properly, okay? Here, you have to look properly. Um,
Okay. Wait. Hanan. Uh, just wait, yeah. Hanan cannot come in. Okay. So, um, so these are the information that we have, which has been given here. Okay. In the office here. Now, the worksheet has 11 columns, like I said, okay? You have filled up uh, the A, B, C, okay? And then you are going to fill up another six more columns, okay? Check the data, okay? These are the data. You did this already, fill in the file. So you have done that, okay? Save everything. Okay, now discuss with your friends on how to use appropriate formula to calculate values. For column E, F, I, J, and K. So these are the formula that they give here, okay? Formula for column E. So these are entering formula, okay? I am not going to this formula yet, okay? I need you to fill in the data first, okay? So uh, you can also, you can use the formula. Okay, I think we have time. Or do we not? Let me check. Huh? Mm, one, two, three, four. No, the formula is too long. This needs another lesson. Okay. So in your test later, in your test later, uh, what you will do is, uh, our test is only up to filling in data. I will not give you formula yet. Okay. Formula is uh, needs another lesson. So when you get your data later, okay, Fill in. I am going to post this in Edmodo. Please follow this. Please do the offer first. Okay. Do the offer. This one we have done it already. Leave it. Okay. Uh, when I asked you to create the file earlier, meaning that you have done this already. So our next lesson later, mm, not next week. Okay, let's try. Okay, let's try. So, the formula, let's proceed to formula now. Okay, I'm trying, I hope. Okay, formula for column E is down payment payable E. Okay, this is E here. Equal to minimum down payment. Click equal to follow the instructions. Okay, minimum down payment. Where is minimum down payment? Okay, minimum down payment. Okay, minus. Trade in offered price. You follow exactly what they say. Press enter. Okay. And then just drag and you can see the answer. Okay, you see? Formula for column E. Okay. Down payment payable E is equal to minimum down payment minus trade in offered price c minus d so this is the c uh, this is the e so this here you can see is actually instruction on how to do uh, or you can just see in my video okay so this is the down payment okay principal loan amount okay let's go to the next one column f and i okay now we are going to column f and i so let's go to f first okay what did the What did the question ask you to do? Formula to call for column F. Okay, formula for column F is principal loan amount. Okay, column F equal to new car price, which are B. Okay, new car price. Minus minimum minimum down payment. Minus minimum down payment. Okay. So press enter. Okay. Right. You can see. Okay. I. Formula for column I. Okay. Okay. So this formula all will be given to you. Don't worry. Okay. Formula for column I is. 
uh, total interest. Uh, okay, total interest. We are trying to find total interest here. Equal to principal loan amount. Where is principal loan amount? Okay. Okay. Times. Okay. Okay. Here comes the interest rate. Okay. Sorry. We cannot do this. We have to change the interest rate. Highlight. Uh, wait. Oh, yo, yo, yo. Number. Allah. Format. Highlight. Currency. Accounting. Percentage. Set to percentage. I. Okay. No, it's already in percentage. Okay, 3.35. If you want to set this to percentage, you have to add 0, 0.0 whatever. Okay, so leave this. Okay, let's see. Total interest is equal to, leave this as it is. Okay, let's follow this principal loan amount. Okay, okay. Times duration. Times. Where is duration? Years. Okay. And times the interest rate. Teacher, I don't understand. Why are you multiplying? Why aren't you oh, adding? Uh, this one, you follow the uh, question. They ask you to follow the question. You follow whatever is written. Uh, follow the... Uh, follow the how to say uh, formula that they give okay formula that they give in this case this one okay wait I think this one should be zero wait huh? let me just zero point three five then only you can get right uh, percentage okay total interest yeah i don't want this format cell uh, why did they do the rounded rounding uh? accounting currency number let's see how ah okay correct okay so this is how it works you have to do this you have to change this into percentage okay so or i think another way for you to do is okay just highlight first before you fill in percentage this is another way also i think it works there are many ways to do this uh percentage okay so when we type 3.35 uh yeah so before you fill in the interest rate, you change it to percentage. Also, it will work. Or you can follow what I said. Change it in percentage uh, 0. Uh, 0. 0.035. Right. Over 100, right? 3.35, 3 3.5% over 100. And then you change it to percentage. Also can. Then only it will work. Okay. These are among the things that you should, uh, no, not should. These are among the things uh, or the tips that you do when you are working with percentage in a spreadsheet. Okay. Okay. So. The teacher, mm -hmm. I, I, don't, I don't think I got the answer from my question because like, I really don't understand like total interest. Why, like what to highlight and not. Sorry. Again, I don't, don't understand, understand what you did. Not. You don't understand? Yeah. Not talking about the person. Okay, you don't understand why this thing, why it's supposed to be like this. Yeah, I don't understand how did you find interest on like. Okay, the interest is in another page. Okay, and the interest is in um, uh, uh, they give they give the formula and you follow. Okay. Uh, I have uh, okay. Let me just show you this one. Okay, these are the formula that they give for E. Okay, there's another one page. Okay, okay, here, 
Okay, I will snap the picture and give it to you. And you follow the formula. Understand? So what you have to do is just follow the formula. Did I answer you? Yes. Wait. Is so how did you make the interest rate in percentage? Uh, how do I make the interest rate and percentage? What I did is, okay, before I fill in, say, before you fill in 3.5, why is all 3.5? I don't understand. Just now it was all 3. 3.3. 3. 3. 3.3. Another one is? Uh, C. Should you just type it? Yeah, three point two, three point two. Because I drag just now. Another one is five. So five. isn't the top one three point three five? Three point three five. Yeah, three point three five. Okay, and the last one is three. Ah, okay, so Ramis, what you will do before you fill in the interest rate? Remember, I told you earlier, leave the interest rate first. Okay, so before you fill in the interest rate, okay, what you do, you highlight the column first. Okay, change it to percentage. Okay, and click OK. So when you type 3.35, it will appear in percentage form. That's all. Understand, Ramis? This is uh, formatting the cell. Okay. Okay, that's how you do. Or another way what I did just now is, because I fill in already 3.35. This is wrong, yeah? Oh, okay, already it's <laughs> later, later. This one later. This one is another way of doing percentage. Let's follow what I said just now. Okay, before you fill in, change the cell to percentage format, percentage format. Okay. So then here, I write on that cell. Yeah, then you type in that cell. Okay. And then here, okay, you follow the uh the instruction that they gave. Okay, they gave the first one is okay, because I don't understand why it's the first one is to find E. Okay. To find E is equal to equal to C C minus D. Okay. These are the formula that they give. Let me just show you here so that you won't get confused. Okay. Okay. So to find E, E is equal to C minus D. Number two. Okay. Number two is to find F. Okay. To find F. Okay. To find F, what you will do is B minus C. Okay. B minus C. Okay. To find I. Okay. I. Equal to. Okay. Uh, F. Times. G times H. Okay. So all this will be given to you. Okay. All this will be given to you. Number three. Number four. Column J. We have to hurry a bit here. J if not. Okay. Number J is to find column J. Where is J? J. Okay. To find J is equal to uh, F plus i f plus i okay and then to find k k is equal to to find k 
J then K uh, J five uh, okay J five minus but times twelve J five G five let's go to J five okay J five divided by okay total loan J five okay divided by this is very important g5 times 12 close the bracket so g j5 where is g g5 total loan okay in order to know total loan okay enter okay teacher then we multiply by 12 yeah Multiply by 12. Okay. Multiply by 12. Formula is J5. is the most important column. And the formula is J5 divided by. Okay. This is J5 total loan. Okay. So total loan is equal to. Oh, no, no, no. We cannot go there first. We did here. We did this already, right? Did we do this? We did this. Uh, okay, and then we did this already. We did this already. Now, J, did we do J yet? Okay, J, J is equal to F1. Where is F? Uh, uh, F plus I. Where is F? Okay, F plus. I, where is I? Here. Enter. So this is J. Yeah. Okay. So this is J. We did this. Now, let's go to this. In order to know monthly installment, okay, what you will do is J5. Where is J5? Equal to. Always start with equal to. J5. Okay, divided by, in bracket, divided by G5, okay, the year, plus the interest. This is actually math. Uh, times 12. Okay, this is year, times 12. In one year, we have 12 uh, months, right? So, in order for us to know the monthly installment, how much we have to know is the total loan that we have. Okay. And then we have to times five and uh, times five years and divide by 12. Okay. So, this is the monthly installment. Okay. This is the monthly installment. Don't forget to format the cell number. And you can see which one is the highest that she has to pay. Mr. Wilson has to pay and which one is the smallest. Okay. The page. Okay. The page. I'll give you one more page. Yeah. Uh, I will uh, post these two pages. Okay. Uh, in Edmodo. And please check. Okay. Uh, please check. And you follow the video. But the, how to say, the... The summary of the uh, formula are here. Okay. Summary of the formula are here. But the instruction... Teacher, do I have... To... Huh? Sorry, sorry. Continue. But the full instructions are inside the book. Okay. They will teach you which button to, to, to press. Like this, step this, step this. So, I think you all know already here. The most important thing is this part. Right? The formula itself. The most important thing is this part. So, in your exam later, in your test later, okay, uh, you have something like this to do. Okay, I will give you uh, a case. Wait, wait, wait. And then, um, go through the data that you have to fill in and go through the formula that I give and start filling in. Okay, and you can get the answer. Inshallah. Okay, if you follow. Okay. So am I clear so far here? 
Yes. Nabila, any question that you want to ask? Before I let you go and I uh, uh, I post this inside your uh, inside the Edmodo. I have a question. Okay. On K teacher, okay. on the monthly installment, uh, J5 uh, mm -hmm. divided by, do I have to write the brackets? You have to I do must? bracket, yeah. Look, there is bracket here. J5 divided by, in the bracket, you have to put G5 times 12. Okay, how did you round them up? What did oh, you press? Rounding is the same. I mean, right click, format cell, number, decimal place, zero. Okay. Okay. Any yeah, question? Right. Okay, thank you. Okay, any question that you want to ask? Nabila, I have a question. Teacher, okay. are we getting any holidays before December? Huh? Holidays? At the end, it has yeah. nothing to do with November, November, midterm break. First until okay. seven. Okay, thank you. Okay. Okay, anything that you want to ask that is related <laughs> to our lesson? But that, that is quite thank cute, you know? Yes? I have a question. Okay, what? Are you going to put the submission box for this? today yeah uh i will put today but uh, i will not lock the submission. i did not lock the submission did you realize that i haven't locked your submission any of your submission of assignment i never lock it but i will put this by today after this i will have to post in youtube first and give the link like usual why why baby because I'm done, so I was just like curious, are you going to post it now or later? Why? After I'm done, I post. That's how I do always. After I'm done uh, in... Then I post. 